When I started playing, it was uh, it was Mark Knopfler. Yeah. Dire Straits. Yeah. Definitely. I think uh, yeah, I played all the songs and I played you know his uh, all his licks. <laughs> With, with all this, with a little less, with, with a little less, uh, less, delay, less delay, and all this, all these, oh, yeah. uh, I, I played only with my fingers at that point. Oh wow! Yeah, I still do that a lot because mm. it has a different tone, you know, yeah. to it. But uh, but of course, there are some things that requires a pick. So, <laughs> but uh, but that was my big hero. That was yeah. Mark Knopfler, definitely. Do you get your drive from pedals or? I get my drive from pedals. Okay. I actually just. It's a different story when I record stuff. I also mm. use, you know, uh, a, a dirty channel amp, and mm. but live I use as clean sound as possible. Okay. And then pedals. Yeah. And then experiment a lot with the uh, different overdrives. Yeah. At the same time. Okay, so using stacking them together for yes, different effects. Yes. Yeah. And experimenting with the order of them and stuff like that to yeah. get a. I also did that on my on the last album. <laughs> All right, so um, you like the you like the tape sound? You like that better than the than the analog one? Yeah, or? I like that. Uh, I like that a lot. I would like to try to have uh, some uh, some dynamics, yeah. some more dynamic delay. In yeah. So I'll just add some a little bit of damping while you're playing. The trick is to find that spot where it doesn't sound yeah. unnatural. I don't know yeah. if it's too much still. So, mm. if we take that as just like a starting point, mm. um, what we could do then is we could sort of say that this could be the twelve o'clock position. Yeah. So, if you put the if you put the pots at twelve o'clock, yeah. then that's the kind of sound that you'd get. Yeah, then it would sound like this. Then it'll sound like this, and then we can kind of you know then you can you know decide how much delay time do you want. So yeah. you have an option of going from say you know. I don't know, 20 milliseconds so to we, whatever you need. So we kind of uh, set a, a maximum delay time I can reach yeah, with this. Yeah, you can do yeah, that. Okay. But but the nice thing is that with this, you know, with the software, what you can do is you can sort of say that this sound would be your 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 core sound, and setting the you know everything at 12 o'clock yeah. would give you that you know that basic go-to sound. Okay. And then we can sort of take it from there. Yeah. Um, the other thing is the uh, the feedback. Yeah. Right now, the way this is mapped. Goes from you know from zero to to mm. ninety nine percent so that it's almost yeah. infinite. It yeah. won't go like you know insanely overboard. It won't go over the top. No, it won't yeah. go over the top. I like that possibility. You like that possibility? Yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. I like that. Now it goes over the top. You won't be able to do it on the pot because that's that's restricted. But yeah, on the on yeah, the software, yeah, you can do that. Now I'll, I'll load the one that you just did. Yeah, I like I like it better because it's it uh, it seems more lush in the sound yeah. to me. How would it sound to add just a little bit of modulation yeah, on it? Yeah, we can do that. Just a tiny bit, just uh, to hear the. So there are different options. So we have some we have some chorus. Yeah. So obviously that's uh, that's dry sound, dry delay sound, and modulated delay sound mixed yeah. together. So you have chorus just on the. On the delay repeats, okay, and then there's vibrato, which would be more like traditional tape echo, where yeah. the entire tape sound is is wobbling. So everything you get from the delay is actually pitch modulated. Yeah, but you can hear the two different ones. Yeah. I just tried them. 
So now we can try to add the add a bit of modulation. And and then the delay time should be around four hundred. It's yeah. It still is over. No, it changes. Yeah. How odd. Two nine five. It says. Mm, I can feel it. it, it yeah, it, yeah. It feels wrong. <laughs> Of course, it's to me it sounds more. Uh, it's a more lush sound with yeah. this chorus. Of course, it's a different thing. I mean, two different yeah. things. Um, but I, I like I like this uh, with the, with the touch of chorus. Yeah. Know. And should it be yeah. subtle? Because we also I think you heard before the the tri chorus, which is a little more. Uh, for lack of a better word, 80s kind of, you know, okay. more processed sound. Yeah. Um, we can try that. Yeah. Uh, let's see, there you go. I'll just add some more modulation here to these. I like that sound, <laughs> even though it's it's uh, back in back in time. Yeah. I, mean, I feel like playing. Easy. So now you get that big kind of yeah. nice washy washy yeah, feeling. That's exactly. really nice when it's. Yeah. That's definitely a, a good uh, good option. Yeah. But I think I will for now. I will stick to the to without without modulation yeah. on the delay. Cool. Yeah, it is really nice. I mean, for it stuff like that, it's, uh, it sounds good. Cool. Yeah. 